So hi everyone, today we are going to discuss another a video regarding the Master of Health Information Management and this course comes under the PR Occupations list. So in my previous video, I have discussed top 7 courses for healthcare professionals who are looking to migrate to Australia. They want to know that which course can give them the PR visa. So this course, one of their, them, basically if you are MBBS doctor, BDS, pharmacy, um, nursing or any other healthcare degree holder, now you are looking a healthcare degree basically, you know, that course can give you a PR visa the so master of health information management this course can give you a PR visa okay so I'm going to discuss basically the um, whole process regarding the, um, this course so if you are new in my channel please like and subscribe my video so I can make more videos for you, you my name is Dr. Akramid I am a pharmacist and lecturer in Australia so we always make content for you if you are looking to migrate to Australia we also help you to complete your A to Z registration process whether you are a medical doctor pharmacist nurse lab technician free therapist optometrist certain doctor anyone so we provide all the assistance including the coaching for you from Australia so easily you can pass at the academically so Ajay Jacket check in for academically now I'm going to discuss regarding this course it is that information for you basically it is a two-year course and the yearly fees basically like a 33,400 per year I can see you know, 120 credit, credit point for year so around 33,400 uh, Australian dollar you need to pay yearly this is a two-year course full-time and uh, three four years you can do it as a part time but if you are international candidate you have to do full time not as the, the part time okay so basically uh, this is um, basically a board rank is there online hai, both are modules so it's very easy for you and uh, simultaneously you can enroll in this course and you can prepare yourself for your registration for example for amc exam for mbbs doctor ladies for dentist caps for pharmacist aim for lab technician you know apc for free therapist so like this you can prepare the, uh, yourself and you can also enroll in this course so basically in this course once you completed this course after two years then you need at least one year work experience then you have to apply for skill assessment to and um, then after that once you got positive assessment then only you can apply for pr visa and getting a job little bit tough after this course um, but if you are got, uh, getting a job if you are ready to work in regional areas definitely there is a go, uh, good chance for you uh, to work in regional areas so basically once you completed this course where you can work so there is four important major roles you can uh, uh, work there you can work as a like health information manager so then and then you also can work as a clinical coder and you also can work as a healthcare data analyst or medical research officer these are the four jobs uh, you are eligible uh, to got once you uh, pass this course and most likely when you are applying for the visa you have to apply for a health information manager so they need at least one year experience for this and eligibility for this program basically any bachelor degree if you complete it from your home country and you are eligible to apply and now we can see the english requirement can what the english requirement for this course so english requirement at least you have 6.5 or 7 you know overall then you can eligible to apply for this program this course is very very limited university karwati is course but a lot of university jo hai wo karwati hai melbourne campus mein for this course and you have to apply online application for this course as i mentioned 33400 for 120 credit points this is the fees for this and yeah this is the information available for regarding this course because this is not very popular course like other courses like master of public health or mba healthcare management kind of things you know on, on those courses there is no pr in that case also if you, if you are looking a low cost course then you can choose mph and Come on that course and simultaneously you can prepare yourself for registration process in that way you can get easily your job and pr visa in australia okay this is very high the fees for this course and there's not very uh, good you know i can say scope for to getting a job and pr you know uh, so i can say mediocre high uh, scope is there is still uh, for this course so if you are comparing that there is second option you want if you are not able to clear like many students are like scared that i am not able to uh, clear this amc exam part 2 or adc exam you know so in that case i need a secondary course which can like choose so in that case you can cho choose this course but mainly you know a both both there's a high salary when you know once you complete this course you will get around 100,000 90,000 uh, like this the salary for per year whether you are a medical doctor or a pharmacist or nurse okay so 100,000 ka aspect mein salary rehta hai iska aapko samajh mein aaya hoga ki aapko karna kya hai basically ye high cost course hai par itna acha outcome nahi hai as compared to other but you can go for like you know registration path with and it it leave can so academically we will help you to complete this process and if you are new in my channel please like and subscribe my video and please leave a comment below if you have any other questions or if you want to make me a new video on any other topic i will see you in my another video thank you bye bye